What's happening guys? Mike here from Hammer Fitness. Today we're going to get my legs waxed. <laughs> I've never been waxed before. Um, but all I want to talk to you guys today is uh, about is uh, facing fears. Now, I don't want to go get my legs waxed because it's going to freaking hurt. Um, I'm not one to actually have shaved or waxed legs, but just the fear factor. I ask my clients to do a lot of things. Um, and sometimes if it's females and they say they're going through pain and then they try to, you know, compensate with something else like, you don't know what it's like, maybe with either legs, like waxing or whatever. So, look, I thought I'd face a fear of pain and go get my legs waxed today, uh, as well as my back. All right, so I'm going to one of my lovely clients, uh, Nicole, she owns her business down in the beautiful basin so we're gonna go visit her she's gonna have all kinds of fun putting me in all kinds of pain so I'm gonna cover this topic quite a bit in terms of facing fears this is gonna be one of the most crucial things to do in your life to not only one push your boundaries and two build up your threshold of fear and anxiety and stress all right so this is the main point i'm actually trying to get at with doing all kinds of stupid stuff or fun stuff or painful stuff um, is actually facing any fear that you may have whether it be through pain or thrill whatever it is uh, that's why i'm going to get my legs waxed so look you face your fears you push your boundaries you build up a threshold this way it's almost like i've spoken in another video before uh constructive stress so you're putting your body under a certain type of stress <clears throat> that's actually good for you. It's not an unnecessary stress uh, per se. You're essentially kind of, let's say if stress was a muscle, you're building, uh, you're building that muscle up to actually handle more stress. All right? And if you can handle more stress, you're technically gonna be less stressed all right, in any other situation in life. All right? Stay tuned guys. So that was definitely not as bad as I thought. If you need your legs or anything waxed that doesn't hurt, come visit Nicole. <laughs> she does an awesome job. So there we go. Fear challenge number one done. Till the next one. Done. So that actually wasn't as bad as I thought. I'm not too sure if uh, Nicole was absolutely skilled at not hurting you or uh, for the pure fact that I was that afraid of getting hurt with waxing that I built it up more in my head And I think that's the problem sometimes with a lot of your fears um, You build them up a lot more <laughs> than they even need to be So next time take a look at your fears really think about it logically maybe even just face it and do it uh, often when you Shove it away. I mean this isn't something necessarily I was shoving away. I just didn't want to get hurt, but it definitely wasn't as bad as I thought, and I think you can actually find that with a lot of things that you do. Uh, things aren't as bad as they always seem. Right, so don't always judge a book by its cover, especially your fears, because I know that you are strong, um, and you should know that as well. So face your fears, push your limits, push your boundaries and threshold, become less stressed, and just be happier. I'm happy I got my legs shaved. No, not really, I just feel very smooth. <laughs> Peace out for now, guys. I'll see you in the next video.